फ्रॉम द जेकर ऑफ उत्तर प्रदेश टू मध्य प्रदेश चंदेरी फ्रॉम द फुलकारी ऑफ पंजाब टू द ब्रोकेर ऑफ बनारस हैंडलूम वीविंग इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट वाइब्रेंट एस्पेक्ट ऑफ इंडियन कल्चरल हेरिटेज टू वीव द फ्यूचर ऑफ हैंडलूम इंडस्ट्री द गवर्नमेंट हैज कॉन्स्टिट्यूटेड अ कमेटी फॉर डबलिंग द प्रोडक्शन एंड क्वार ड्रपलिंग द एक्सपोर्ट्स ऑफ हैंडलूम इन अ स्पैन ऑफ थ्री ईयर्स The committee has been formed to suggest the road map and boost India's handloom sector. Let's get to know more about the terms of reference of the committee. It will help in suggesting the strategy and policy framework for doubling the production and for improving the quality of handloom products to enhance the income of the weavers. It will also look into the partnering and collaboration of handloom weaver agencies with the designers, buying houses, institutions, organizations and exporters. It will further recommend the ways and means for promoting handloom products in the domestic markets. Also, the committee is expected to come up with the measures for improving the input supplies like raw materials, credit technology upgradation, skilling and designs. It is worth noting that the committee is required to submit its preliminary recommendations within 30 days and a final report within 45 days from the day of its constitution. Now let's understand more about India's handloom industry. The Indian handloom industry is one of the oldest and the largest cottage industries with 23.77 lakh looms. The level of artistry and intricacy achieved in handloom fabrics is unparalleled and certain weaves or designs are still beyond the scope of modern machines. The sector has provided employment to 43.31 lakh weavers directly and indirectly throughout the country and almost every state of India has a unique handloom product to offer. To strengthen the nation's handloom sector, several important initiatives have been undertaken by the government. One of the major schemes is the Comprehensive Handloom Cluster Development Scheme. It aims to develop mega handloom clusters that are located in clearly identifiable geographical locations and specializes in specific products. It also focuses on improving the infrastructure facilities, offering better storage facilities. technology upgradation in pre loom all loom post loom operations weaving shed skill upgradation design inputs and health facilities next in the line we have the national handloom development program which include important schemes like block level cluster handloom marketing assistance weavers mudra scheme education of handloom weavers and their children india handloom brand and the promotion of e marketing of handloom products through e commerce Besides the yarn supply scheme is also an important initiative which is being implemented throughout the country to make available all types of yarn at mill gate price the success of these timely interventions can be attributed to the fact that over 125 countries globally are buying handloom products from india indian handlooms are truly preserving the nation's timeless traditions by maintaining originality and offering the best to the people we will be back with some more updates thanks for watching